So we shot this footage this summer. We had to wait to show it to you until the agreement between the city and the team were finalized, and now it is, so enjoy. You may have read that the uh, Potomac Nationals are uh, planning to relocate to the city of Fredericksburg, so we wanted to ask the Silbers why you were attracted to Fredericksburg. I think there's probably uh, one major answer, Bill, and that is an unbelievable sense of community and community identification. There was no other place in Northern Virginia that had the sense of community identity, uh, community pride, and quite candidly, uh, the type of welcome that we got, I think both from uh, city staff, from the uh, uh, city council, from the business community, and the people as a whole. So tell me a little bit more about what it's been like to work with the city of Fredericksburg and also the local business community. Uh, you've blown us away. Uh, you've been uh, so welcoming uh, in terms of uh, staff, uh, elected officials, uh, the meetings that we've had with the business community to try to explain the project and how really what we're doing is a huge partnership that everybody's going to be involved with. Uh, it's been extraordinary. So you would certainly encourage other, other businesses to look our way? Uh, one of the checklists that uh, any business has when it's considering relocation is what are the amenities that a community's got? What type of entertainment does it have? Uh, how affordable is it? And when you look at the 160 minor league teams throughout the United States, uh, they're all in thriving communities. And, uh, and we believe we can really contribute to that. Can't wait to see you here and thriving in Fredericksburg in April 2020. We look forward to opening day. 2020, you're going to have to be one of the people who throws out an opening <laughs> pitch. All right, I'll have to start practicing. <laughs> <laughs>